Dr. Francis Collins is the director of the National Institutes of Health. He has been described as, quote, the man who holds the most powerful job in American science. President Obama recently tasked him with two projects, the Precision Medicine Initiative and the Brain Initiative. The Precision Medicine Initiative provided new approaches to disease treatment and prevention. I saw something that may have been associated with NIH about chronic fatigue. Yes. Did you write something? <laughs> it just happened. So <laughs> That's what I I've, been, I've been puzzled and uh, frustrated about how little we understand about this condition. Now, just as here's a theme we've been I'm talking about fatigue. the whole time. What is it? Yeah. <laughs> but chronic fatigue syndrome, no. people who have that diagnosis, it's a very heterogeneous collection of individuals. But the Institute of Medicine has just sort of defined what we should sort of limit it to is people who are profoundly affected by fatigue oftentimes coming on How after an acute, by you can't fatigue? get out of bed. Oh. You are disabled. You're right. utterly unable to carry out daily activities. Uh, you have other things which exertion seems to make you worse instead of better. Uh, and you have sleep disorders. Uh, sleep is not refreshing as it should be. You may have postural hypotension where you stand up, your blood pressure drops, and then you pass out. This is serious it's stuff. It's serious stuff. And it's particularly frustrating to see cases, and they're hundreds of thousands of them, of people who were healthy and then have what appears to be just a flu-like illness, but they go to bed and then they can't get up for months. So we just announced we are going to make a big push to try to get the answer here. Bring some of these new technologies of genomics and proteomics and metabolomics and imaging and figure out what is going on in this condition.